Now, Pierre Elliott Trudeau and many other people believe that our rights are better protected by a written charter, so that if if Parliament passes a law that restricts our freedom of speech, you know, he's, well, the charter says we have freedom of expression, Charter Section 2B, so then you take the law to court and the, the judges can strike down the Parliament's restrictions on free speech. My, my argument is basically that freedom of speech is going to be protected first and foremost by cultural acceptance, whereby if you have 90% of the people that understand that in a free society, you have the right to say what you want and that you know other people can't silence you just because they find what you're saying to be really, really offensive. If 90% or even 80% of the population, if they get that, that's what protects free speech. At conversely, if you've only got 10 or 20 or 30% of people that understand that free speech necessarily must include a right to offend other people, and a lot of Canadians don't get that. You'll hear Canadians tell you with a straight face, oh yeah, you know, I totally support freedom of expression, you know, as long as it's not offensive. It's like, well then, <laughs> if we have a right to not be offended, then nobody has a right to free speech. And conversely, if we all have a right to free speech, then nobody has a right to not be offended. But they're contradictory. You can't say I support free speech uh, as long as the speech is not offensive. Well, that's not free speech. So I would argue that it was, a, it, yes, it was a big shift in 40 years ago to go from a British-style parliamentary sovereignty system to an American-style constitutional democracy system where you could take the law to court and the court could strike down the law, right? That as the Americans have been doing for 200 years or more prior to 1982, and so we had that big shift, and it was certainly significant, but I'm not convinced that the Charter has protected our rights and freedoms. In fact, I, th I think we were uh, much more of a free country 40 years ago than what we are today. <laughs>